Hello, hello, are you there? Hi, Esmeralda, how are you? Es que, Wilfredo, fui a tres Esmeralda, por eso es que me desconecté. No, teacher, cuando yo entré, usted se fue. Oh, my goodness, es que la vi que iba entrando. Y yo dije, oye, el teacher, lo que hizo. No, so, no, no se hace. No, no se hace. Yeah, there we go. No, I'm sorry, no I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Esmeralda. I won't do it again, okay? It won't happen again. Hmm. Okay. Uh, okay, go ahead, uh, Gomez. Uh, go ahead and read your uh, your homework. Okay. okay. Uh, my email is... Uh, this, uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, Jean, Melvin, hey, don't forget the report. At 3 p.m., they meet this meeting. Okay. okay, is that it? Okay, muy poquito, muy poquito. Too short, okay. Ah, Eres bien tacaño. <laughs> okay, okay, very good. Thank you, thank you. All right, uh, Edwin. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi. Uh, did you do your homework? Uh, no. No. Yeah, um... Okay, no. Okay, very good. Uh, Cesar, Manfredi, did you do your homework? Uh, excuse me, teacher. The homework. Uh, um, yes, uh, the the mail I I read uh, uh, on Friday. No, the homework is for today. I don't remember. What okay, the... era era que usted era un eh, iba él estaba a cargo de un grupo y el grupo iban a ir a otra compañía y usted iba a preparar las etiquetas del comportamiento de ellos se acuerda que todavía estuvimos haciendo eh, eh, we were joking que, que no fuera como María ahí en la compañía de María que todos salen corriendo a la cafetería esa iba a ser sí esa iba a ser una de las etiquetas que íbamos a poner que no fueran corriendo si iban a ver lunch que no fueran corriendo is it homework que estaba para hoy? Solo Wilfredo lo hizo? Los demás no? I, be, I will be honest, I don't remember that. Uh... Ah, okay. Okay. Okay, uh, Esmeralda? I, I remember uh, I read some uh, etiquette, <laughs> uh, but the homework, no. Okay, yeah, ese era el homework, traer, eh, eh, es eh, hacer como pretender que usted es el jefe y, uh, y eh, escribir las etiquetas, hacer un manual con las etiquetas. Eh, Wilfredo hizo nueve etiquetas, así que todos tapense los ojos así, lo siento, ya. Yeah. Ya, yeah, there we go. Ok. Eh, mm, no, 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 no. Yo aquí anoté, y, pero lo tengo el del correo nada más. Sí, mm, sí. Ok. Pero ahí okay. está en, en, la, en la grabación, en la clase. Ya lo voy a ver porque no. Sí, no hay que ver la, en la, y ahí no, no hay donde perderse en la clase. Ahí va a salir que. Eh, eh, ok. Si no, ok, very good. Pero si no lo trajimos, tranquilo, no hay problema. Y, Lo pueden traer mañana. Yes. Tomorrow. Tomorrow is... Uh, uh, well, tomorrow we're going to start the chapter four. The, tomorrow we start chapter four and it will be our last week. And uh, this uh, uh, module will be finishing on Monday. Monday the 14th. Okay? So, uh, quienes no han trabajado en la platform, uh, it's time for you to work on the platform and try to finish at least uh, unit three today 
Okay, so a lot of you have already uh, done uh, even the, the final the exam. So thank you for that. And the rest of you just uh, try to uh, do it to that tonight. So you can't go to sleep tonight. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's uh, let's uh, work on the uh, um, on the book. And on the book uh, we have this is uh, this is what uh, we were working. Like I said, we were working on on this uh, manual where you are to, you were supposed to be the uh, the the person who was uh, guiding these people to the other company, and we were um, we were, we wrote uh, this uh, etiquette uh, on Friday. We were working on this one. Uh, remember, we were discussing about uh, whenever if you're at the uh, having lunch with your friends or your col colleagues, and if your phone rang, uh, if your phone. Uh, um, you know, somebody gives you a call while you're eating. The, the best thing to do is to, to just uh, answer the phone and uh, walk away where where people will not be listening to, to your conversation. And uh, over here, uh, these are the cards that we were reading. And we say that uh, this is where the homework came about. And uh, you were supposed to uh, write uh, etiquettes. Uh, a, indicating your employees things they shouldn't do at the other uh, company, okay? And it says you are in charge of a group that is going to visit another company to make an alliance. Write a short etiquette etiquette uh, manual for your colleagues. Ese era eh, el homework, okay? Y, y ahora lo vamos a comparar. Compare your manual with different uh, pair. Le vamos a comparar ahora con diferentes. Uh, vamos a pretend we are going to pretend that we did it, and we are going to uh, uh, compare our manuals, okay? Uh, and uh, do the manuals share several etiquette rules? Uh, eso y vamos a ver a ver si los manuales que ustedes traían tenían las mismas etiquetas, las mismas reglas y yeah? etiquettes. Pero no, no, no. Don't worry. Eh? La vamos a hacer mañana posiblemente, ¿ok? Entonces, vamos a... Eh, this is un, un puzzle, un crossword puzzle. Este es donde eh, nosotros íbamos a, a, a practicar las, las etiquetas, las, las que teníamos. Por ejemplo, tenemos aquí guidelines, uh, polite, manners, regards, punctual, uh, latecomers, uh, behavior, salutation, and subject. A latecomer es, uh, es, son las personas que llegan tarde a los trabajos. Eso les llaman latecomers. Yeah? Latecomers porque todo el tiempo están tarde. No es, eh, es, es not that uh, you will have an emergency or some, something came, came along and you were not able to make it uh, on time to your, to your workplace. These latecomers are people that they're always late, always, always late uh, uh, for work. And uh, they always give excuses that, that uh, uh, the traffic, uh, uh, somebody is sick uh, in their family or they're getting sick or whatever, whatever the excuses they give. Uh, they are called late comers. Yeah. And uh, uh, punctual, being punctual is the, are the people who are always on time for work. Salutation, we said that it was greetings and uh, uh uh, guidelines are rules that uh, we have to abide uh, by those rules. Otherwise, uh, we will be like uh, uh, um, somebody's going to call our attention, say you're not uh, going by the rules that uh, you're supposed to follow. Okay. And manners is uh, how do you conduct at the workplace? And the etiquettes are the rules that you follow. Uh, okay. And uh, so over here, we are supposed to look for those, uh, 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 for these words. Now let's go ahead and try to find them over here. If we can do that, can are you able to see this uh, uh, this table? Yes. Yes. Yes, we are. Okay. 
Okay, try to find a, a word and let me know where the word is. So, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. These are rows and these are columns. So we have 12 rows and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve columns. So in case that uh, if you find the word uh, on the six columns, which is this one, in third row, you, you just tell me, hey, on uh, six column and the third row is uh, one of the words. So I, I will go over here. And this is this is the, the point, right? And I will just uh, do this. Yeah. And I will mark the word for you, okay? So let's see if we, if we can find... Uh, this uh, two, four, six, eight, ten words. Teacher. Yes. Uh, row twelve, uh, column uh, eleven. Row twelve. Row column twelve, 11, column right eleven. Uh huh. That two. But but Bottom. From the bottom. Yes, it's right here. The bottom. It's the P. Yes, uh, you should go uh, back, backward. Okay, backwards? Polite. B polite. Ah, polite, yes. Uh -huh. Okay, so polite. Yeah, right here. Polite, yeah? Uh, line one, subject. Line one. Sergeant. One right here. Sergeant. Uh, or the right. right here. Yes. Sergeant. Yes. Um uh line eleven. Uh no, so sorry. Uh row. Column, column and row. Row R O W row is row. And column. I can't. We. I can't. Uh, row, row number two. And column eleven, from the bottom. Salutation. Okay. Sa salutation. What row number? 11. Row 11 right here, okay. And column 11 from the bottom. Column 11 right here. Up, salutation. Oh, yes, yes. Salutation. Yes, you're right, right here. Yes, salutation, yeah. Okay. And you say column, column, column three, Wilfred? No, column number two, uh, row number 10. Row 10, right column, no, no, Sorry, sorry, sorry. Row number two, column uh, 10. Two, row 10, here. Okay. Uh, uh, down. Etiquette. Et etiquette. Yeah. Uh, right here, etiquette, yeah. Very good. Column six. Column six, one, two, three, four, five, six. No, uh, column. No. Column six, right here. Uh, yeah. Uh, row four. One, two, three, four, oh. right here. No, five, 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 five. five sorry, right here. Uh -huh. Manners. Manners, yes. Row. Manners, yes. Right here, men's, yes. Uh, other one, teacher. Uh -huh. Column seven. Row number two, column seven. Row seven, uh huh. Uh, down is behavior. Behavior, yeah. Edwin, did you say something? No, teacher, buscando todavía. Oh, okay. Behavior, yeah, right here. Behavior. 
Column 12. Column 12, right here. Uh huh. And row 10. Row guideline. 10. Right here. Guidelines. Yeah. Okay. Manfred, you have one? Esmeralda, do you have one? Edgar, do you, Giovanni, yes. Column number two. Column two, yes. And roll 12. Oh, well, oh, punctual. 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 Yeah, punctual. Este, eh, row five, teacher. Row five, one, two, three, four, five, uh-huh. Digo, six, entonces. Six. Column three. Column three, uh-huh. Regards. Eh, no. Regards. Regards. Regards, yes. Okay. Teacher, um, yes. column nine. Column nine, uh-huh. Uh, from down to up, uh, late comer is it in the fila. Uh, it's a row, row is fila, row. In column, de arriba para abajo. Okay. Uh, row, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve, uh huh. Twelve. And then this is this. Column and row nine. Column and row nine. Okay. That's correct. Okay, yes. column, row, row nine, uh huh, and column nine. Nine, okay, right here. Oh no, it is the one up. Okay, one up. right here. Yeah. Uh, late comers, huh? Late comer, yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah. There you go. Very good. Yeah. Yep, we got it. Yeah, we got it. Yeah, very good. We got it. My goodness, <clears throat> this is a, a good, uh, thank you, Esmeralda, for all of your help. Hmm. Thank you, Manfredi. Okay, very good. Let's see. Now, uh, choose five words from the word search and write a sentence per each. So you're gonna choose one word and you're gonna write a sentence for each of the words that you have chosen, okay? Let's go ahead and take a, a, about 10 minutes to do that. So for example, um, if you select punctual, yeah, uh, you say is a, is a, a good edit, edit, etiquette to be punctual at work, because yeah, you show respect to the company. Yes, that would be a good uh, sentence. So one sentence for each word that you select. So, so you just need to select uh, five words. All right. Seleccione cinco palabras de estas y hace una oración con cada palabra.
Are we almost done? Hey, Jorge, you look very relaxed. Uh, yes, teacher, <laughs> I finish. <laughs> okay. It's it's hot today. Today is very hot, huh? It was very hot. Yes, it's so hot. Uh, I don't know, but it's hot because mm. I keep I keep my my t-shirt. <laughs> I only I have the t-shirt. Yeah, that's, it sounds it it feels like you are very very relaxed with that teacher on. <laughs> yes. All right. Yeah. All right, uh, can you give me your uh, answer, your uh, your sentences, please? Yes, teacher. Okay. Uh, a latecomer shows little interest in, in his work. Okay, uh, a latecomer uh, shows a little interest uh, at the workplace, okay? In the workplace, <laughs> yes. Okay. Um, a punctual, person is an example to follow at work. Very good. Uh, yes. A person who was who always is punctual is a good example to follow. Yes. Uh, this phrase is, is the movie, is the Kinsman manners, okay. made the man. <laughs> <laughs> you hear me, teacher? Yes, I did. Yes. Manners. Uh, yes. Manners make the man. <laughs> yeah, man make the man. man. Yes. <laughs> the movie Kinsman. Um, the four sentence four is maintain good behavior at work. Say a lot about the employees. Yes. Okay. Very good. Uh, be polite to everyone, so you can earn uh, to the respect of the others. Yes, yes. If you're polite, you definitely people will respect you. Yeah. Is okay. all <laughs> very good. Thank you. Thank you, Jorge. Very good. Good job. Good job. Okay. Um, Gomez. Okay, teacher. Mm -hmm. eh, yo le digo las mías. Eh, must be punctual with the time us entry to work. Okay. Must be punctual. Uh, uh -huh. uh, you should use good manner at lunch. <laughs> okay. You should show good manners at lunch. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, uh, good behavior should be used in the meeting. Okay, good behavior should be used in the meeting. Okay. Solo uh -huh. uh, teacher. Okay, very good. Thank you, um, Cesar. Okay. Um, the old man uh, moved away, raising his hands in salutation. Okay. Uh, the other and the same sort of question is uh, sentence. Obviously, uh, he told her, ah, no, 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 no. César, dime, ese es otro cuaderno. Ese es otro cuaderno. <laughs> 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 <Okay>. Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Obviously, he thought her manner of dress was too casual. Okay, casual. And casual. Uh, be, beware of beware of him who regards not this reputation. Okay. Uh, only that teacher. Okay, very good. Thank Para you. Para de cuaderno. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ya, ya iba a decir, two millions uh, in months of uh, November. No, no, not this one, teacher. It's different ones. Okay. <laughs> okay, very good. 
Esmeralda. My God, you look like a movie uh, uh, star today, today, Esmeralda. What's Thank going you, on? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Um, number one. Okay. Salutation. Mm -hmm. The salutation are rule of courtesy. A courtesy, okay. A courtesy. Etic etiquette. Um, etiquette are form are forms of education. Okay. Es una forma de educación. No sé si está bien escrita. Sí, sí, sí. Es un so. Es una. Uh, manners. Good manners make good people. Okay. Very good. Good manners make um, you look good, right? Okay. Yes. Yeah. Be my behavior must always be correct. Yes. Okay. Very good. And me falta uno. Yes. Um, being punctual is showing respect to others. Yes, that's true. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Thank you. Uh, Dennis Ramos, how are you today, sir? Hi, teacher. Uh, Hi. Bueno, yo solo hice tres y bueno, no sé si también escritas, pero bueno, la primera, eh, be late comer is an a good, a good etiquette. Okay. Be uh, late comers, okay. Sí. Eh, be punctual, eh, bueno, perdón, be punctual is, uh, is in all situation is to be respectful. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Eh, be polite eh, with all people, help you to be a better person. A better person, yes, it makes you feel better. You know, if you're polite, uh, whenever you get to the workplace and you're polite, a polite person, then your your day is, it makes your day easier. Yeah. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Um, okay. Um, let me see. Okay. Um, Latecomer. Latecomer is a bad behavior in a professional company, and be a latecomer has consequences. Yes. It has um, uh -huh. Is the good pronunciation teacher of the last word? Yes. Consequences. That's what I was going to consequences. Say. Huh? Consequences. How is consequences? Consequences. consequences. I, get, I got it. Mm -hmm. um, polite. Greet everyone and being polite is a good custom. Yes. Um, guidelines. It's a good idea to have a manual or guidelines in order to know what to do in some events. That's good. Um, yes. Subject on emails. It is important. Don't forget the subject because it tells us what the email is about or at least we have an idea. There we go. And yeah. the last one, the last one, the behavior, a good or a bad behavior tells who we are. Yes. That's all teacher. Yes, our behavior, remember, behavior is our ID, is what uh, we represent. Very good. Correct. Excellent. Good job. Uh, Edwin? Hi, teacher. Hi. Okay, um, I am a punctual person to get to work, and the etiquette are nouns that says and demonstrate respect, uh -huh. and the man the manners influence people's attitude. Attitude, no sé cómo se pronuncia. Attitude, attitude, attitude. Uh -huh. Okay, and behind polite shows a lot how you are it yes and true and my behave behave behavioral behavior uh -huh. behavior is quite good before others mm -hmm. that's true Finish. yes remember um uh i think carlos uh, says yesterday he said yesterday that uh, 
the best thing to do, the best thing to, uh, for us to, how we can show the etiquette is uh, doing those things first. You know, if we do them, then other people will follow us. So that means that, uh, you know, behavior is very important. If you, if, if you show, if, if we show that uh, a good behavior, other people will follow that, uh, will imitate our behavior. But if we don't never show the good behavior, then people will not notice that we exist. <laughs> okay, very good. Uh, Maria. Maria? Jesus Martinez? No? Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. I'm so sorry. I'm not at home. Oh, you're not home. All right. Okay, but is everything okay, Maria? Yes, teacher. Okay, very Thank good. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Mario? Okay. There. Carlos, Antonio? Neither. All right. Okay, so I guess uh, we are done with the uh, um, the activity. Well done. Congratulations to all of you. You're doing a good job. Now, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to see, we go, we're going to have a, a little review of the uh, would and could. Remember those uh, modal verbs that we were using in uh, uh, today? We, are, we have some uh, uh, sentences over here that they have mistakes. So our job is will be to find those mistakes and correct the mistakes. On the first one, it says uh, identified and correct three mistakes in the request below. Would you mind moving your car? It's blocking mine. You could fill this purchase order. Uh, would you sending this invitation to your assistant? Uh, would you mind ordering something to eat? And could you coming earlier tomorrow? We need to receive our visitors. So find three mistakes in these uh, five sentences. Okay and rewrite the sentence correctly. Okay, let's see if we can do number three. Uh, would you and could you? Would you mind and could you mind? Okay, let's see. Let's start with uh, uh, sentence number one. Would you mind moving your car? It's blocking mine. What is the problem in that sentence? Dennis? Uh, yo no le veo error. No sé si. Ok. Eh, ok. A la segunda. Uh -huh. Teacher, la, la primera de, de la ¿Sí? número. 
Número tres. Number one. Yo, Number este, three. Yo, yo veo que dice moving y sería como que te importaría mover y ahí diría que te importaría moviendo tu carro. No. Mm. Te diría chut. Eh, teacher, yo creo que no sé si oye muy rudo. Sí, muy rudo. Would you? Would you mind? Eso lo aprendimos que era, era polite. Would you mind? Yes. Um, um... Eh, fíjense que eh, Dennis está en lo correcto. Esa está correcta. Would you mind uh, moving your car? It's blocking mine. Yes. Esa está correcta. What about number two? Number two is a question, and we should use the modal verb um, at the for beginning. The, the beginning, yes. Yes. Right. Is that that the correct, is the, that okay. is the, the correct one. Will be uh, be. Could you fill this purchase order? Yes. Could you fill this purchase order? Yes. Eso sería la primera. Si sí. eh, sería el modal verb goes uh, at the beginning of the sentence when. We are making a question. Very good. Eso sería. Entonces, uh, el problema aquí sería esto. Esto, esto aquí. Esto va al principio. Okay, number three. The mistake is uh, sending. Sending is the problem, yes. Uh, remember that when we are using um, a, the modal verb would, we have to use uh, the verb in the uh, base form. So would you send this invitation to your assistant? Very good. What about number four? Um, Esmeralda, ordering. Mm -hmm. Se ve algo raro ahí en esa. Would you mind ordering something to eat? Oh, it is correct. It, it is correct. Yes, yes, it is correct. Would you mind ordering something? It. It's okay. It's, it's like, uh, like the one, would you mind moving your car? Would you mind ordering? See, it's the same uh, structure. Uh, okay, number five. El coming. Coming. Mm -hmm. Yes. El coming el coming, coming el es el problema. Sí. Tiene que estar el verbo en su base form. Could you come? Could you come? Could, Could you, you come, come early tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Yes. Could you come early tomorrow? We need to receive our visitors. Very good. Okay. Let me uh, call roll y nos vamos a tomar la taz tacita de café porque eh, Esmeralda ya quiere la tacita de café. Ok, vamos a ver, eh, Carlos Antonio. Ha dormido. Bien. Yeah. <risa> Carlos, <risa> Carlos Rosales Flores. No. Ok, uh, I have uh, César <coughs> I'm here, I'm here. Thank you. And uh, Dennis Vladimir. Present. Thank you, sir. Edgar Edimir. Well, okay. Present. All right. Uh, Edwin Alexis Rodriguez. Present. Thank you. Emerson Eli. Present, teacher. Thank you. Hey, esa fue una voz de, de locutor. Present. Que estoy enfermo, teacher. Okay. <laughs> Eric Armando. No, okay. Uh, Esmeralda Noemí. Presente, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Giovanni Alexander. 
Present teacher. Thank you. Email Alberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Jacobo de Jesus. Present teacher. Thank you. Jonathan Salvador. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge Alberto Orellana. Present teacher. Thank you. And Maria Jesus Martinez. Present. Thank you. Mario Osvaldo Martinez. Present, Mr. Thank you, sir. Melissa Esther Orellana. Present teacher. Thank you. Sandra Janet Benitez. Senia uh, Judith Peña. Okay. Y, uh, Wilfredo Antonio. Present. Thank you, Wilfredo. Okay, let's go ahead and take a 10 minutes break. We're coming back at uh, 10, 9, 13, all right? Okay, enjoy your break.
Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, Wilfredo. Not enough time, huh? Not enough time, no. Definitely. No, but for, <laughs> but for me, it's enough that I have, um, I'm ready, I'm ready. Okay, very good, excellent, excellent. Okay, um, let's see. So the next uh, exercise is uh, we are going to select the most appropriate answer for the request. Remember that uh, would, it makes a uh, more polite, Yes, I would. Or oh, if uh, somebody's asking you with would, you are supposed to answer uh, back with would. So on this one, we have five questions in uh, well, five sentences, and there is an answer. Uh, for example, the first one says, would you mind turning the lights on? And uh, either you say no problem or yes, I would. So you're going to select the best answer to, uh, to the question, okay? So let's go ahead and take a, a few minutes uh, to do that exercise. Hello? Okay, so for each answer, there is a, for each question, there are two an possible answers. So you're gonna select the, the, the one that sounds more appropriate to the question. I was saying to, uh, to uh, uh, your classmate that the first one, it says, would you mind turning the lights on? So you're going to select either no problem or yes, I would. The one you think is better, okay? Okay, let's see. All right, uh, Gomez, uh, what would be the best uh, selection for uh, sentence number one? Uh, yes, I would. Yes, I would. Yes, I would. Yeah, because if you say no problem, it's, uh, it's like uh, it's not uh, formal, right? Yes, I would. Uh, number two, Dennis? It's uh, Bueno, sería, could you order some time to eat, please? Yes, something. I could. Yes, yeah, something. something. Yeah, something. yes, I could. Yes, I could. Yes, very good. Esmeralda, number three. Um. I could do it. It will be, could you request more uh, jumbo paper clips, please? I could right do it. Away. Oh, right, right away, right away, right away. Yes. In este instante, in este instante. Yeah, very good. Uh, Jorge? Number 
would you mind getting 10 copies of this report? Yes. Uh, in a minute. No, I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't. Eh, would you mind es cuando le pregunta, por ejemplo, eh, ¿te molestaría? Eh, ¿Te molestaría ir a traer 10, 10 copias de este reporte? Yeah. Entonces, cuando dice, no, I wouldn't. No, 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 no me molestaría. Yes. Ah. Yes. Ah, Entonces, okay. Would I you, got it. Yeah, would you mind? Very good. Uh, number five, uh, César. Number five, yes, I could. Yes, I could. Excuse me, could you turn down the volume a bit? Yes, I could. Very good, excellent. Ahora este, este ejercicio number five is más challenge, ¿ok? Porque aquí nosotros tenemos que dar una sugerencia, right? A suggestion about the following behavior. Por ejemplo, uh, if the person is coming late, now the, if I ask you, write a, 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 um, a suggestion about uh, uh, this person coming late, what would you tell him? Yeah. Entonces, te escribes uh, una sugerencia. En este caso, son uh, five sentences. Uh, Sara never stops chatting on the phone when we have lunch. Eh, ¿Cuál va a ser la sugerencia que usted va a hacer? Entonces, usted va a hacer una sugerencia y la va a escribir y después me la va a leer, ¿ok? So, son cinco sugerencias. Let's go ahead and take a few minutes to do this. <laughs> so we will not get uh, bored.
Almost done. Almost, almost teacher. Okay. Oh, you're home, Maria. Good. Hi, teacher. Hi. We are we are working. I don't know if you if you were listening, but the, we are working on uh, uh, exercise five, and what we're doing is uh, for each of the sentence, we are writing a suggestion, like uh, remember etiquette, uh, behavior. The, we're trying to write uh, some suggestion uh, for each sentence. For example, the first one says, uh, Sara never stops chatting on the phone when we have lunch. So we're gonna uh, give a suggestion to Sara to not do that, but in a polite way. And so is number two, my boss does not like to walk to my desk when he needs something. He shouts at me from his desk. So we're going to make a suggestion for him not to do that. Okay. 
Okay, I will try. Okay. That's that's the attitude. I will try. No fear. Okay, I guess we are done, right? Jorge, here, are you done? Uh, I think so. <laughs> you think so? Okay. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Uh, let me hear your suggestions. Um, Sarah, the one, Sarah never stopped talking to the phone when we had lunch. Uh, she should uh, stop using the cell phone um, so she can enjoy her food. Yeah, but remember that uh, uh, one of the uh, suggestions, it was that, uh, yes, they can answer the phone while they, they're eating, but... Uh, we need to tell Sarah uh, that uh, not that she can't do that because we will not be able to uh, come to, to uh, an agreement. But yes, uh, Sarah never stop chatting on the phone when we have lunch. We can say, Sarah, uh, would you mind, uh, you know, um, you know, uh, taking the phone call but uh, away from us so we can we can eat uh, our lunch. That would be a suggestion, ¿verdad? Que, que contestara el teléfono, sí, pero, pero que se alejara para donde, donde ustedes no la pudieran oír para, para que ustedes pudieran comer tranquilos. So, esa sería una suggestion que yo hiciera, ¿verdad? Pero la suya, ¿cuál fue? Ah, que ella dejara de usar su teléfono. She should stop using the cell phone so uh -huh. she can enjoy, enjoy her food. O sea, Ella podría disfrutar su comida, pues. Her lunch, ella... yes. Perdón? Her lunch, yes. Uh -huh. Okay, very o sea... good. Okay, very good. Number two. Mm, dice my boss. No le gusta. Ah, que le grita. Mm. No escribiste las respuestas. Sí, 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 ahorita. <ríe> es que las estoy leyendo. <ríe> oh, yeah. Eh... Se nos fue. Se acabó. Hello. Yes, yes. Te, te nos fuiste. Ah, no sé, he tenido siempre estos problemas que se cortan. Uh, uh, sí. Uh, your boss should be more respectful and not demonstrate his authority in that way. Okay, okay. Uh, so, so, que, so, so que tiene, ¿Cuál es la solución entonces? Sorry. Yes, porque tomo <laughs> cuando él necesita algo, dice, ¿qué es lo que debería de hacer él? Levantarse. Okay. So, Way up. Come to my desk. Ajá, o llamarlo, pero... O call, igual. Me. O call me, yes, so I can approach his desk. Yes, ok. Um, three... Um, Jimena and Susan, uh, you should use your phones in your free, in your free time not in the work. Okay. Dice cuando ellos están en el trabajo, at working. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cuando ellos están haciendo su, sus uh, uh -huh. tareas. Okay. So they shouldn't bring their phone to the workplace. Mm -hmm. okay. um, four is um, Pablo Pachina. Uh -huh. Um, avoid, avoiding talking to the co-workers does not help 
to get a better result and the work. Hmm? Avoiding talking to co-workers does not help to get better results at work. It looks like he's the boss. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but mm, I don't know. Maybe it's a co-worker. Maybe it's a partner is co-worker. I don't know. <laughs> but then uh, it's specific because Pablo, Pablo publica letrero, no es un buen momento en la puerta de su oficina. Mm -hmm. para, su equipo, para que su equipo no le hable o no le diga algo. Mm -hmm. eh, por eso recomiendo, o bueno, hago la, la mención de que evitar hablar con los compañeros de trabajo no ayuda a, a dar mejores resultados en el trabajo. Pero ¿qué le sugerirías a Pablo tú? ¿Qué sería tu sugerencia? Pablo, si tú... If you, uh, ¿cómo se diría? Dar mejores resultados. Si tú, if you. No lo want escribiste, no lo escribiste. Uh, Pablo, if you want to give a better result in the work, you maybe talk with your co workers. Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Jorge. Uh, Wilfredo? Mm. Uh, the number one. Uh, Sara, would you mind left your phone for some minutes at last at lunch and talk with us? Okay. Please? Okay. Number two. Um, he should be more polite and say, could you do me a favor? I need you get me the last report, for example. Mm -hmm. Number three, would you mind be more concentrated at work and take selfies in your free time, please? Okay. <clears throat> okay. Next one, mm, he should go outside if he wants to stay alone or maybe change the sign as follow. I'll be back in 10 minutes, Pablo. Um, the last one, Graciela should sign his emails, her emails with a professional sign because emojis are informal ways. Yeah, my emojis are informal. So uh, Graciela, please do not sign your emails with the emojis. Uh, they don't look professional, yeah. I would be the right. suggestion, yes. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, good job. Uh, maybe, let's see, let me try it. Uh, okay, Esmeralda? Oh, um, uh -huh. Intenté, teacher. No okay. sé si está bien. Good job, good job. Um, number one. Sarah, mm -hmm. could you stop sharing on the phone, please? Okay. Uh, number two, could you come to my desk, please? Okay. <laughs> que venga a mi escritorio, me grite yes. aquí. Yes. Huh? <laughs> uh, number three, go stop talking selfies at work. Okay. Uh, Paul, call talk to you. Okay, good. Talk to you. Could I talk? And to you? Graciela, you should, shouldn't use emojis in your emails. Okay, you shouldn't use the emojis in your email. Very good, excellent. Thank you, thank you. Dennis Ramos. Uh, eh, me puede dar un minuto más. <laughs> okay, very good. Uh, uh, Jacobo. Lo único que no le ha puesto en orden. No hay problema, tranquilo. Sería. La cinco. Five, the five. Graciela should not lose 
emojis in her email. Okay, very good. Uh, Sara. Uh, Sara should put her cell phone away before lunch. Okay. Uh, That's a good su That's a good suggestion. Put away the phone uh, while okay. she's eating it. Yes. Yeah. And she put the decks together. <laughs> They should use their cell phone to take selfies at work. Okay. Y la última creo que es Pablo. Pablo dice, Pablo should be more social with his co-workers. Okay, should be more social, yes. Uh -huh. uh, so she should have an open doors, open doors so he can talk to mm -hmm. people. And whenever people need uh, his help, they is he is there. Okay, very good, excellent, good job, uh, Gomez, uh, Cesar. Okay. Um, the first suggestion uh, is Sarah should stop talking on the on the phone while every lunch. Okay. Second, uh, my boss shouldn't be yelling from his desk when he needs something. Okay, what he should do? Um, Jimena and Susan should put their phone away when they, they are working. They are okay. working. Okay. Pablo... Pablo should improve the post if he doesn't want to want to bother bother when he's he is be uh, he is busy. <clears throat> okay. Um, and Graciela, Graciela should stop uh, signing her emails with emoji. Emojis. Okay. Very good, excellent, good job. Uh, okay. okay, este, solo las primeras tres. Ahí me quedé. Okay. That's uh, good. And Sara, she should put the funds outside for when she goes to the eat lunch. Okay. And the, the boss, he should ask her for things in a good way. Okay. And Jimena and Susan, they should take the photos afterwards. After work, yes, okay. Only, only that. Okay, very good, good job. And uh, uh, Maria, Jesus. No las hice todas, teacher, pero creo que lo, lo intenté. Okay, okay, el número uno. Cinco dólares por cada una. <laughs> Me deben todavía los 30 de la semana pasada. Sí, pero es que es hasta el final no, del mes. No hay. Mes. Al final del mes. No hay integridad. No, al final del mes. Porque no me mes. pagaron. Así que no hay, no hay responsabilidad. ¿Dónde ha visto que le pagan diario? Es al la final semana del pasada, mes. Al final del mes. Cuando, cuando, mire, al final eh, del mes. Todavía contabilidad. Menfredi, ¿cómo está la contabilidad ahí? ¿Lleva, lleva toda la planilla bien? Sí. Oh, yeah. Ok, sí, sí. sí me enfrento esta, esta planilla. Sí, teacher, y esas preferencias. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> ok, what's going on? What's going on? Dice oh, Esmeralda. my what's God. Going on? <laughs> ok, ok. Let's go back to business. <laughs> Let's go back. 
Mejor me muevo a la oración. Ok. okay. No Número estaba uno. dormida, ya vi, ya vi. Ya no, vi. no, ya vi. Un, un ojo tenía cerrado y el otro estaba abierto, sí. Ok. Ok, go ahead. Okay. Excuse me, Sara. Could you continue sharing in the other room, please? Yeah, okay, very good. Yeah, so, so, okay. so you have things to el go número do, El número dos, si no lo, pude, no lo pude hacer, no lo pude, no lo pude responder. Ok, el ese número es, tres, es bueno. Eh, oh, Jimena uh, en su... María, ese es, uh, a lot of companies, they okay. have open doors. Open doors means que cuando usted tiene algún complaint, usted puede ir directamente y hablar con su boss, con su supervisor. Eso se llama open doors. Pero esta persona eh, dice que pone un sign en la puerta y nunca habla con las personas, o sea, eh, como que no, no, no los respeta, yes. no le interesa lo que usted, cuál es la opinión de ellos. Eh, entonces, ¿cuál sería la sugerencia de poner, uh, de decirle a él qué es lo que, qué es lo que le molesta a los empleados que siempre que van a buscarlo es, encuentran ese sign en, en el door? ¿Qué le dije? Si yo fuera su boss y usted siempre que me va a buscar, usted encuentra un sign en la puerta que dice eh, My boss does not like to walk. To... No, no, ese es, es perdón, esa es la, la number four. La number two es que eh, si yo fuera su boss y, y todo el tiempo, María, necesito este reporte ahorita mismo. Yes. Y usted tal vez está trabajando. ¿Qué es lo que me sugeriera a mí usted como... ¿Qué me sugeriera, María? Hello, teacher. Perdón, se me fue la señal. Ok. Esa, la número dos es eso. O sea, que su voz le grite. Se le fue otra vez. <ríe> no, yo creo que María me está, me está cortando. <ríe> no, teacher, I'm here. <ríe> no. Es, es raro que hoy que estoy hablando con ella se va, la, se va, en el, se va en el internet. Es que no quiero tener problemas con Esmeralda. Oh. <ríe> Ya estuvo, ya estuvo. Esta, sí, o sea, solita, okay. voy a evitar los problemas. <risa> okay, no, 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 no quiero hablar, teacher. No, es mentira, tengo, tengo problemas con la señal. Ok, ok. Es que el, teacher, el 2 el no lo entendí bien, entonces no lo hice. Podemos saltarnos okay. al 3. Ok, that's ok, that's ok. Let's, uh, let's go to number 3. Ok. Jimena y Susan, could you take a selfie in your free time, please? Ok, very good. Ok. Um, el número cuatro tampoco lo hice. <risa> <risa> y el número cinco menos. Me no, 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 ¿cómo no, cómo no, ese sí lo traté. Este, okay. Excuse me, Graciela, could you sign your email without emojis? There is no reply. Ok. Could you no, stop sorry. signing your emojis? Could you stop signing your emails with emojis, verdad? Yes. Okay, very good. Excellent. Good job. Okay, thank you. Uh, Dennis. Okay. <laughs> bueno, creo, creo que me enredé todo, pero igual. Oh, sí, Solo yes. hice tres. Uh, bueno, la primera sería eh, Sarah should stop eh, chatting over lunch and chatting later when mm -hmm. she has finished. Eh, y if this continues, eh, she can give uh, um, in the gestion. No sé si okay. ya tiene dicho. Está chateando, está comiendo. Uh, eh, no sé si dice gritar, pero eh, chose. Eh, oh, ¿Cómo sería la pronunciación? Por ejemplo, gritar a las personas. Y yeah, ese es shouting, es, es como se llama gritarle, ¿verdad? Y yelling, yelling también. Shouting. Mm -hmm. eh, okay. Por ejemplo, shouting to the people isn't polite, eh, okay. is a disrespect person, and isn't a good behavior for a boss. For boss. Yes. Eh, he should eh, grab and go to employee's desk. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Jimena, Jimena and Susan shouldn't. Uh, to take in uh, safe fields in working time. Uh, if the boss see this, uh, they can be fired. Okay. Uh, 
they will take safe fields in break. Okay. Only that. <laughs> okay, very good, very good. I think that, that those are very clear, clear uh, uh, suggest, suggestion. Thank you very much. Uh, anybody else wants to give me suggestions? All right. Okay, let's go to um, uh, exercise number six. And this exercise number six, um, what this is trying to see is if, if we have uh, very clear between uh, formal and informal suggestions or formal and informal signatures. Uh, we have see you, hey, what's up? Hello, mister, hello, miss, dear friend, my best morning, best regards and thanks. And so, so, yeah. <laughs> okay, so which one are formal and which one are informal? That's uh, is for you to decide which one, which one is which. Okay, go ahead. See ya is a informal. See ya, yes, yeah, see ya is an informal. See, yes. Ah, uh, hey. Two. Yeah, hey. Hey is an uh, informal. What's up is informal. Uh, informal. Of things is uh, informal and social informal. Okay. The other one is the formal form. Which one? My best is formal, morning, formal. Uh, best regret is formal. Morning, morning is formal. Morning, morning is informal. 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 Yeah. Morning uh, yeah, is yeah, informal. Yeah. yeah, okay. Uh, best, re best regards for is formal. No. Best regards? It's formal. It's formal. It's formal. It's formal. formal. Yeah, formal. Yes, Best I regards. say is formal. I say yeah. is formal. Okay. okay, ya lo enojaron, ya lo enojaron. <laughs> no, it's because it's in the room, it's the echo. No le pague, room. teacher, no le pague. No, le, no, no, no. <laughs> no. Le vamos a descontar el, el séptimo. <laughs> no me han pagado. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yes, best regard is formal. A hello, Mr. or Miss is, is formal. And dear friend is formal, right? The yes. rest of them are informal. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Okay. And uh, tomorrow we are going to start uh, unit four. Four. And in this unit, uh, we are going to be learning new things. And uh, we're going to start by... Uh, um, looking about uh, travel services and accommodations. Travel services are the services que eh, nos, nos dan cuando nosotros viajamos, ¿verdad? Y accommodations son las, uh, um, las cosas que recibimos. Por ejemplo, eh, una ca un cuarto con dos rooms, uh, eh, eh, asientos uh, reclinables, eh, air conditioning, todo ese tipo de, de cosas bonitas que nos dan. Eh, eso es lo, lo que vamos a, a nosotros a ver en el, en el uh, chapter unit 4 eh, que es con, va a ser mañana yeah. eh, lo que vamos a hacer es uh, uh, ver uh, acerca de eh, bueno el primer diálogo que vamos a ver es acerca de eh, una reservación cuando usted llama ¿cómo se llama la persona que, que recibe la llamada? eso ya lo vimos ¿verdad? ¿cómo se llama esa persona? Se llama receptionist. Receptionist, sí yes. Se llama receptionist. Es la persona que recibe, que la recibe a usted o recibe la llamada. Yeah. Y, y cuando le dice good morning, ¿cómo se llama eso? Es un greeting, ¿verdad? ¿Se acuerdan los greetings? Greeting. Yes, le da un greeting. Yeah. ¿Y qué, de otra forma que podemos decir reservation? Aprendimos otra forma de cómo decir reservation. ¿Alguien se acuerda? ¿Alguien se acuerda cómo se dice reservation? I would like to book a room. 
Se acuerdan que eso lo vimos. How to book a room. Shukli? Book. Book a room. I'm calling to, I would like to book a room. I would like to book a, a, a flight. Yeah. Eso es uh, de otra forma como decir reservation. Yeah. Entonces en este, en este chapter, we are going to learn how to request, uh, request information about travel services and accommodation related to a business trip. Un business trip. I, I trip the leisure trip, o sea, vacation trip, ¿verdad? Donde nosotros vamos y nos vamos a divertir. Pero un business trip es diferente. No nos vamos a divertir, ¿verdad? Y todo, aunque veamos las cosas, oh my goodness, eso se ve eh, genial, pero no me puedo divertir porque es un business trip. Um, vamos a make a hotel reservation and request uh, related services. Vamos a, a aprender. We will learn how to make a, a hotel reservation and uh, ask for services like uh, room services, yeah, um, wake up services, uh, uh, transportation services, todo ese tipo de, de, de servicios. Vamos a aprender cómo hacerlos. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Entonces, y también vamos a request and provide instructions about the means of transportation to get to a place. Means of transportation. ¿Qué es lo que queremos decir cuando decimos means of transportation? Means of transportation serían medios de transporte. ¿ya? ¿Cuántos medios de transporte conocemos? Tres. Airplane. Airplane. Train. Train. Car. Car. Uh, motorcycle. Motorcycle. Bicycle. Bicycle. Car. Yes. Train. Train, dijo Manfredi. Yes, train. Um, no, Jorge. <laughs> <laughs> Ok, ok, Jorge. Jorge, Jorge anda agresivo hoy. No, es que, es que yo, no sé, yo no sé qué le pasa. No ha Va a levantar pesas, quizás. Ya, y dice, ¿quién? Yeah, yo, yo, yo. Es yo. que no le ofrecieron el bono por las respuestas. Eso es no, todo. Es que no hubo bono no soy la por eso. Conforme. Ok. Esa es la forma como demuestra que está inconforme, ¿verdad? No, yo fui primero. No, okay. para nada, sino okay. que lo que pasa es que me ganan los honores, teacher. Ah, ok. Es el caballo de los enviados y entonces mejor, mejor los conservo. Ok. Ok. So, the, that is where we are heading, ok? And, uh, so, we, I'm going to call roll and uh, we're going to call the night. Cuando digo call the night es hasta ahí vamos a llegar. Es uh, call the night en inglés quiere decir como que hasta aquí llegamos y ya nos vamos a despedir. Ok, so en caso de que estaban eh, preguntándose cuando el teacher dice call the night, ¿qué quiere decir? verdad? Pero eso es cuando, por ejemplo, usted está, usted está en su trabajo y su boss le dice, oh, we're going to call the day. Call the day quiere decir hasta ahí vamos a llegar. Yeah. Entonces, uh, uh, we're going to call the night. And uh, vamos a pasar a uh, lista. Eh, call roll. Roll, yes. Okay, vamos a César Manfredi. Are you still there? I'm here. I'm here. Oh, thank you. Dennis Vlad Vladimir. Present. Thank you. Uh, Edgar Edemir. Present. Thank you. Edwin Alexis. Present. Thank you. Emerson Eli Moreira. López. Emerson, no. Ok. Uh, Eric Armando Flores Linares. No. Esmeralda Noemí López. Present, teacher. Thank you. Giovanni Alexander Ramos. Present, teacher. Thank you, sir. Imer Alberto Sánchez. Present, teacher. Thank you, sir. Jacobo de Jesús Gómez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Jonathan Lorsan Zavala. Present teacher. 
Thank you, uh, Jorge Alberto Orellana. Jorge! Teacher. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Uh, Maria Jesus Martinez. Present. Thank you. Mario Osvaldo Martinez. Present. Thank you, sir. Uh, Melissa Esther Orellana. Melissa, no. Okay. Uh, Sandra Janet Benitez. Okay. And Senia Judith Peña Diaz. No. Y Wilfredo Antonio Luna Sosa. Present. Okay. Very good. All right. Uh, we're going to call the night and uh, I need to talk to Mario. Good night, everyone. See you. Hello? Hola, what happened? Come on, no. What happened? Hi, Wilfredo. 